Hey, so today we are reading notes, right? Um, just remember, we talked about D being at the bottom of the staff. It's the note that sits right at the bottom of the first line on the staff. And A is the note that goes on the second space of the staff. This is D and this is A. So what I want you to do is practice playing those two notes while reading. We're going to start with page number four on your book and I'm gonna walk you through how to practice all your lessons. For example, let's do lesson three together. Ready? So first thing is you're going to sing it or say it. You're going to say the notes and so we're going to say D, D, A, A, rest, 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 A, A, D, D, rest, 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 rest. Okay, once you've said the names of the notes right, what we're going to do is we're going to take our bow and practice saying it while we move our bow in the air. So something you can do is put a little cloth on your shoulder just so you don't get rotten on your clothes and practice going up and down. So even if you're not on the violin, you still have to practice having good bow hold. And remember, we want to move just this part of our hand, not the whole thing, not up and down, just back and forth, right? So we're going to do our lesson while you're reading your notes and we're going to say D, D, A, A, rest, 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 A, A, D, D, rest, 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 rest. Once you feel confident with that, then we're going to play it, okay? Make sure you're looking at your music, should be in front of you. And what you're going to do is go to play position. Make sure you put your bow in the air. And the first note is going to be D. So you're going to land silently on D. And while you're reading your music, your hand can be on the shoulder of your violin. We're going to say, D, D, rest, rest, don't move, and D, rest, 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 rest. And that's what I want you to do with every lesson. You don't have to do all the page in one day. I want you to just focus on one or two lessons a day and practice it until you feel very confident. If you have any questions, remember, just let me know.